Do I? It's been a long time. <laughs> Let's do this. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Madeline Rebecca here. I know it's been a long time. Last time you saw me, I was terrified about living alone. Went through a lot of mental issues. Like I mental issues. I make myself sound crazy, but I like, as you could see in my last vlog, like I was so scared to live alone. I didn't know what to do. Um, I thought I was ready to move out. And I don't know if you're ever officially ready to like move out for the last time from your parents. Like it's sad. Also remember like me, my mom, my sister, my dad, like we all came here together. So it was like, they were everything I knew. So I was alone, I was terrified. I didn't know what would happen. And I had this whole apartment just to sit in and I wasn't ready for it. So yes, it's been a couple months. No, I didn't take you guys along with me during that process, but I will say that there are some things that you should keep offline and there's some growth that needs to be done for just you. Like it did feel good not reporting everything of the growth, not like having to check in. Yes, I love talking to you guys and I love being on this channel. This is where my heart and soul is. And if you look at my vlogs, you know that. But I think to become the person you need to be, sometimes you do need to take a step back. And I really took a step back from everything in my life. I am back. Um, I don't know what schedule I'll be on or what videos I'm gonna be posting, but my life is completely different now, um, genuinely. But I wanna start out with an apartment tour because last thing you guys saw was my empty one. Yeah, it's changed. Well, like and subscribe below if you wanna see more videos of me. I moved to Florida from my hometown 14 hours away and I'm just kind of figuring out my way. So if you have, if you want moving tips, if you want lifestyle vlogs, if you want fashion, if you just want somebody that you can relate to, I hope I can be that person. So let's get started. So you walk in and this is Mo's little corner. Yes, it's tacky. I'm not a big fan of this if we're being honest, but it is what it is. So I pull that out whenever I leave and he has this whole little roam, like area to roam. Um, he's very spoiled, yes. But then you have this. This is one of my favorite little corners. That's my abroad book. Me and Keeman picked out that candle and then I have the lavender and there's that. I have my little corner for the moon and then I have one of my favorite tables. Um, got this on Facebook Marketplace. TJ Maxx, TJ Maxx, TJ Maxx, and that's my Furbo, so I can literally watch Mo whenever I'm not here. Uh, and then I just have that, no biggie. Then I have my picture wall. I also got this from TJ Maxx, and this is where I put the mail. Uh, I never receive mail, so this was very stupid, but it's okay. <laughs> Mo's little area, so that's my calendar. Then I have Mocha, and that's where he's fed. I'm currently washing his bowls, but there's that. Then we have the kitchen. So it's still that open space. I have this that says, great things never came from comfort zones. I'm currently doing my dishes, but there's a little area. Kind of changed the coffee wall. I guess you guys haven't even seen that. Okay, so I'll get to that. There's my little bar on top. Just have a little stuff. That's Mocha. He graduated from PetSmart the other day. I have a box I need to send something back, but that's my air fryer. That's again, most food. I just made myself tea, but here's my little corner over here. Um, you know, obviously, whenever I first moved in, I was like, dear God, what am I gonna do with all my cups? Well, if you see the storage, I think I'm okay. <laughs> like, then you go to my coffee corner, which I am washing my, my thing over there, but there's that. I'm absolutely obsessed with this. And then I got this on um, Chewy, but look at this. So. It's like Moe's bed, but it's also a, like, it doesn't look tacky. You wouldn't even know. I mean, you would know, but you know what I'm saying? It makes it a, like, less, less uh, ugly, because I hated how his cage looked. Then you have the bar still area. There's my cactus, looking real good. The bar cart, which still looks really good. I kind of want to get lights on it. Um, but there's that. Then we have the TV, one of my favorite walls. I got all those from Society6, TJ Maxx, and that's a local artist here. It's actually the stadium in Tampa um, for the Super Bowl, so that's very, very cool. So I have this little corner. I got a lot of the stuff from TJ Maxx, Home Goods, um, but there's that. 
I did have my desk in my room, but I know it's good to like separate it. So that's where I work every day. The couch finally came in, so there's my baby. And if you know, if you follow me on TikTok, it pulls out and actually makes a bed, which is good for visitors. I have a lot of visitors coming. Um, then I have this, which, yeah, ignore how I look, I know. But this is my little photography area, big fan, as always. The patio, it just rained, so ignore it. But finally hung up some lights. That is a lemon and lime plant, which is pretty cool. Definitely could do more out here. Um, and that's one of my little regrets. Um, but this is my little corner. I like to sit there and read. I think it's really pretty and just like watch cars go by. Mo loves to just sit out there and watch cars. Plant, some books. Then we have the room, which I actually just redecorated. So this is still kind of new for me. I got all those on Etsy. Um, and then that's just a picture of me and my friends. And I got this full length mirror on Amazon. Um, if you guys want me to link all this stuff, just let me know and I'll put it below. Um, but that's that. Got that from Society6 as well. Uh, I think I just got the bedding from Home Goods, but I'm a big white gal. Um, and then I have this over here, which I have my TV. I love my record player, my little aesthetic weekend corner. Um, I, like I said, I just recently, my bed was originally there from the last time. I don't know if you guys ever saw that, but you guys did it. I keep on forgetting that I have been lacking. Okay, so the bed was turned right here, but I actually just moved it. And I love it this way. I get to wake up to the sun every morning and fall asleep to the clouds. Um, I finally got my hatch alarm clock, which again allows me to wake up to the sun. Anyway, got some books over there. This is my TikTok award, which is really exciting. Uh, if you don't follow me on TikTok, Madeline Rebecca. It's my little reading corner. There's that. That's my shoe wall. Little picture right there. Like I said, this was all completely different. There's my closet, which a lot of crap, to be honest with you. Um, but decent size walk-in. Like, I think we knew that it was going to be a decent size. Bathroom. Very pretty. I just like the black kind of theme. I have some lavender. This is really cool. You can actually get this like locally. Once it goes down and it's out, they just refill it for you. But it's like it's supposed to be a bathtub. So that was really cool. My mom bought that for me. That's where I put all my skincare. Again, nothing really too, too cool about that. And then I have my laundry room, which I have not really done anything. This is more just like storage. Um, but that's where I put my laundry, where I put my towels. This is where all the towels are at. I read that that broom's supposed to keep away bugs. I don't know, maybe I'm crazy. Yeah, that's my updated apartment tour. Literally completely different. Um, but like I said, yeah, I really took some time to like figure out this apartment. I'm like finally okay to share it. I have not been okay like to share it since then. Um, but it's almost been a year in May. Oh, that literally makes me so anxious. Uh, it's almost been a year. I like finally, like I still go to my parents' house probably twice a week. Um, I watch my sister in the morning on Tuesdays and then like I do stuff on the weekend. But like, I definitely think like getting Mo helped a lot because like I kind of had to stay here. So I had to learn how to make it home because he needed to feel comfortable here. So like, I really think it was like kind of a, a duo for that. Um, and yeah, I just really like have been pushing myself to like figure out why I'm not okay being alone. Why do I have to like be go, go, go? Like I just had to push a lot of stuff back and put a lot of stuff on hold for the time being. But I think, you know, being the best version of yourself, making sure that you're okay alone, like all those things come first before you take any other next steps in life. So I definitely am not like officially there but I, like I said, I finally feel comfortable enough to like show you guys the apartment, get back on here and talk and just kind of like take you guys around. Um, so yeah, updated apartment. If you guys want me to link anything below, just comment and I will definitely share that with you guys. I appreciate it as always, like and subscribe, comment other things that you want to see me like talk about because like I said, I've moved away. I now am doing more influencing stuff. I have a new job. I'm a marketing and communication specialist. So I'm no longer just taking calls. I'm actually like creating content. Um, and yeah, like I have a whole new group of friends here. Like it's just a lot has changed. So if you want me to talk about any of that, how to make friends, 
how to balance like distance and being here like through everything comment below i'm an open book so i can't wait to start talking to you guys again and i hope you guys like my apartment bye